guys, it's Sam. Welcome back to my channel. As you guys can see by the title down there, today's video, it is a first impression on BH Cosmetics as well as a full face, as you guys can see right here. Except for the foundation, I'm actually doing a first impression for that itself. Uh, but I wanted to kind of like come on camera and just try out their products. I've never tried their products before. They were having a sale and they came out with a new collection, which you guys are going to see on the video. Um, but yeah, this is the look that I came out with today. Before we get started, please don't forget to subscribe and the little button down there. And if you want to know how I got this look, then just keep on watching. So I'm actually filming a first impression on this foundation right now. It is the BH Cosmetics BH Liquid uh, Foundation Naturally Flawless. I do want to let you know it is a BH Cosmetics full face because I actually do have the concealer and I have a bronzer or like contouring. I have a blush and I have a highlighter. Um, as well as an eyeshadow. I did not pick up a brow product because they did not have like the shade for me as well as a powder again they did not have that in stock. So those are the two things that I did not pick up but the rest we're gonna use them today. For concealer I'm gonna be taking the BH Studio Pro Total Coverage Concealer and I did pick mine up in the shade 102. Oh it has a it doesn't have like a doFO average applicator it's a plastic doFO applicator which I mean for sanitary reasons I actually do like it I, I like the idea of it I think this shit is actually gonna match me I actually did pretty good with the shades that I picked up um, you guys know that I'm not the best at <laughs> picking up shades of foundation online Actually, that coverage looks really, really nice. I'm going to start off with the um, Weekend Vibes Belgian Waffle 6 Color Baked Bronzer and Highlighting Palette. And can we talk about the packaging? Like, isn't that the cutest thing ever? And wow, I'm like in love with this packaging. So it comes with a mirror right here actually that's a really good size mirror I really like it and these are the shades right there so it does have um, three bronzing shades and I believe this is yeah it's actually like a bronzing shade so bronzing shades and then three highlighters I'm gonna take the shade cinnamon and I'm gonna actually bronze off my face with that one and Okay, wow, I'm like super impressed with this palette, <laughs> super impressed. I'm going to move on to the blushes, and this is a six color blush palette, and this is the packaging right here. Oh my god. I love, um, I love peachy blushes, those are like my favorites. Okay, so this is the palette. I'm going to take these two, so the first lighter ones. And I'm going to combine those two. Wow. Super pigment. I'm going to go back to this palette, which has the contour and the highlighters. And I'm going to take powder sugar, which is this one right here. And I'm just going to take it on my Morphe. That looks beautiful. Oh my god. All three of them look so pretty. So happy with that highlighter would you look at that wow now we're gonna be moving in to the eyes and this is a palette and this is the weekend vibes mimosa and again you slide out from the packaging and oh my god I love the whole like concept of this it's so pretty it has a little plastic too and wow. this is the palette I'm like so excited. I'm ready to do a super peachy eye look. And I think to start off, I'm going to start with the shade Bottomless, which is this pink right here. And I'm going to start off and just put that all across my crease. Wow, 
Wow, that's actually really pigmented. The palette has like a weird scent to it though. On top of that, I'm going to take the shade Vibes, which is this peachy shade right here. So right away, uh, there is so much pigment in this eyeshadows, it, the blendability, like it is so easy to blend. I don't know if you guys can see, but I've used two shadows and they've blended like a dream. And I don't know, I'm like really, really impressed with this. Like, really impressed. I think I want to add a little bit of yellow on my outer cr um, crease. So I'm going to take a little bit of OJ, which is this orange right here. And I'm going to grab that in a tinier brush, an M433. And just going to blend this right here. I don't know, this reminds me of like um, Thrifty's um, Sherbet ice cream, the rainbow ice cream. With a flat shader brush, this is a Sigma E55. And I'm gonna take the shade Guava, which is this one right here. And I'm going to just put that on my lid. And going back with that Morphe M433 that we used OJ, I'm going to go in with Guava a little bit and blend that on this crease. I'm hoping that these don't stain my eyes. I'm actually going to combine Vibes and Guava this one right here and I'm gonna apply those on my lower lash line with a Morphe M5 456 I'm gonna take the shade bottomless which is the first light pink that we used For my inner corner, I'm going to take the shade Champagne, which is this one right here, with a tiny brush. This is a Morphe M515. And... So I'm going to take Pop, and I'm going to apply that with my finger a little bit on the lid. So I actually ordered these glosses as well. These are the So Extra Bloody Mary um, High Shine Plumping Lip Gloss Duo. And I really, I was really excited because actually these ones were not sold out. And I was like, really? Like these are the ones that I would like want to pick up. So this is in the shade Spicy. And this is in the shade So Hydrated. And I think for today I'm going to go in with this one with the clear one. My camera... There we go. So I think I'm going to go in with the shade um, So Hydrated, which is a clear, sparkly one. Hopefully it's not like super sticky. It smells a little weird. Oh wow, they're not sticky at all. I'm going to go in, pop some lashes, and I'll be right back. This is the final look. I am impressed with the quality of these products. Um, based on the price, I have never tried uh, BH Cosmetics products before. I think I had a palette a long time ago and I just, I actually do not remember using that. So it was more kind of like a first impression with their products. Like I said, they were having a sale and it was a really good sale. I'm going to link down everything down below. But yeah, this is the look for today. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe and the little button down there. 
As always, all the products that I use in this video are going to be linked down in the description box as well as on my social media. And until then, I'll see you guys on my next one. Bye!